Hironori Craft Ramen is located in a nondescript strip mall across the parking lot from an office building and in the vicinity of the John Wayne International Airport. The interior sports a pretty spartan decor, uh, nothing fancy here because the main attraction is really the food and that's fine by me. The menu is pretty simple, they only have a few styles of ramen, the most popular of which is the tonkotsu ramen which was what I got both times I went there. And that's what really put them on the map and got them included in the Michelin Guide. The first thing I do is always to take a sip of the soup. For me, the soup really is the measure of a ramen. It's what s distinguishes good ramen from bad ramen and amazing ramen from the rest. And the soup here boys and girls, cats and dogs, it did not disappoint. It, uh, I think sometimes it's hard to find the sweet spot between, between savory and sweet, between a, th a thick broth and a clear broth, but somehow by a hook or by a crook, they found it. The tonkotsu comes only in one size and the default noodle width is thick. Um, I got the thick this time but the thin noodles last time and I think both taste great although if I had to choose I would probably go back to the thin noodles but that's just a personal preference. The egg was good, but nothing to write home about. There is a spicy sauce on the table, which, which I would suggest you taking advantage of because it's really flavorful and it really takes your ramen up a notch. But uh, don't reach for it straight away. You want to really get acquainted with the ramen first before venturing into uh, the world of spice. What really sets this place apart uh, from elsewhere is the char siu pork. It is incredibly tender. Uh, I cannot overemphasize just how tender it is. In fact, you don't even need your teeth. I mean, leave them at home because this char siu pork is so soft, you can chew on it with your gum. And as I demonstrate here, the moment you, pick, you try to pick up the char siu pork, it just uh, falls apart. Uh, quite frankly, it's probably the best tashu pork I've ever tasted in a ramen shop. The second time was just as good and just as impressive as the first time. And they really have this down to a science. And um, needless to say, I recommend this place wholeheartedly.